In this example, let's take a look at how to merge and how to split slides within our project. To start with, I'm going to go ahead and show you how I can easily merge slides. To do this, of course, I'm going to go ahead over to my thumbnails and select the slides that I want to merge into one master slide. I have them selected here, and you'll notice that I have a pause zone here. On this particular slide, the first one selected, each of these actually also has a pause zone. I want you to see what happens when I merge all of these slides into one. So once I have them selected, I then go ahead and click the Merge Slides button along the timeline. And when prompted, I'll go ahead and click Yes. And then you'll notice that all of the slides were merged into one. And if I look along the timeline here, all of my pause zones were also retained when the slides were merged into one. What does this mean? Well, this means if you have additional sound layers, if you have effects added to the different slides, they will also be retained when you merge and or split your slides. Now, the next thing you may want to do is take bigger slides and for whatever reason, split them into one or more slides. You'll have to go ahead and split them one at a time. So I'll show you how to do it and then you can play around with this and experiment on your own. So for example, maybe I want to go ahead and take this slide here and I want to split it maybe right here. So to do that again, I just click along the timeline where I want to, in this case, split the slide to get my playhead right at that tick mark. And then this time I'm going to go ahead and click the split slide icon. When prompted, I click yes and then it will go ahead and split my slides for me. Now here's a little tip. Once it splits the slide, be careful where the selected slide is when you're editing your project because it will normally land on the slide that was split off of the master slide. So in this case, it didn't automatically select slide one, but it went to slide two. So that's the selected slide when I'm editing. So if I need to go back to now, what is now the first slide, I just select it and then I can go and edit as needed. Another thing you do want to keep in mind is that there may be some slides that you are not able to split for whatever reason, or there may be some slides that cannot be merged together because they're not compatible. When this occurs, you will be prompted by Viewlet Builder or warned by Viewlet Builder that the operation cannot be done. That's all there is to it. If you have any questions on this particular topic or any others while working with Carbon's products and services, please visit us online at www.carbon.com. Happy Vuleting!